continuing coverage tonight over the fight over abortion in Georgia. Georgia's heartbeat law is yeah. now officially in effect, which bans most abortions after six weeks of pregnancy. So before the 11th Circuit Court's decision, multiple clinics offered surgical abortions. But what is the difference between this and a medical abortion? 11 Alive's Karis Belger is breaking it down for us tonight. I spoke with our 11 Alive medical expert to explain a surgical and medical abortion. Dr. Sujatha Reddy says both can happen early in a pregnancy and the difference depends on the patient. Dr. Reddy explains surgical or in-clinic abortions happen with a doctor and other medical staff present. Medical tools or instruments are used for the procedure to terminate a pregnancy and anesthesia is involved to help with the patient's comfort. A medical abortion doesn't require those medical tools and a patient is given a pill and it can be taken at home and it often involves excessive bleeding. What a patient may choose depends on their circumstances. These both can be done early in pregnancy. Um, certain conditions are going to make one better for another as far as your medical history, what other medical conditions you have, previous surgeries, things like that are going to affect your ability to have one or the other. Dr. Reddy went on to explain when she consults with a patient, she takes their circumstances into consideration. This includes what kind of support a person has at home and whether they can handle the effects of the pill. 